What up, what up, Wimbush here. And today I wanted to show you guys in this quick tip how we could turn Cinema 4D S25 back to our legacy UI. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. Now I actually like the new UI instead of 25, but I understand a couple of people out there, they wanna kinda of go back to the way that it used to look. And so to do that, we're gonna go back up here into the top right hand corner where it says new layout. You wanna make sure this is switched over to the left and you're not gonna see any changes yet. And that's because we have to pick one of our layouts up here in the top. So I'm just gonna click on standard. And this takes it back to the way that we're used to seeing it inside of 24 or our previous versions of Cinema 4D. And if you wanna take it back to the new UI, all you have to do is come back up here to new layouts, make sure it's clicked over to the right, click on standard again, and there we go. So now this is the new layout inside of Cinema 4D 25. Again, go up to layouts, click standard, and that's gonna take you back to the old way. So it's cool because you can flip flop between the two different UIs and you know, just customize it how you see fit. So it's easy as that for the people that wanna revert back to the old style of the UI in Cinema 4D, but still wanna use 25, that's exactly how you get it done. So if this helped you out, make sure you leave me a comment down below. If you're new, follow me or subscribe to my YouTube channel. And until next time, stay fresh, keep creating, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'll see you soon, take care. What up, what up? Wimbush here.